Yeah, I got a new show for y'all. Got a damn good show. Damn good show. Man, working fast food's got to be tough. I never did that before. I don't think I can handle it. No, that job, um, that job sucks. Just putting on the uniform. Why you take your socks? You never did it before. Oh, think about it, Kevin. You work at Taco Bell. Mm-hmm. That's a nice you uniform they got. You know how much? You know how much girls I can pick up in that Taco Bell uniform? Hey, Kevin, you being serious? No, you being pessimistic. When you look at something, don't look at it like 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 pessimistically. Look at it optimistically. You, you know, ain't picking up no like girls. Like when you look at a glass and it's a half full of water. You looking at that glass, man, that damn glass is half empty. No, that glass is half full. Put a little curl in your hair, put that little Taco Bell outfit. Man, I'd probably get me 10 phone numbers coming through that drive, coming through that window. I'm saying, hey, girl, you want an extra fat taco? Give me your number. You want a big, fat, juicy burrito? <laughs> give me your number. You give me a call. You want some hot sauce all over that face of yours? <laughs> give me the number. Hey, Kim, get serious. No, I'm, I'm serious. A heart attack. I have picked up all kinds of women from all different kinds of places. <laughs> you too, man. I picked up a woman just walking down the street. <laughs> picked up some hitchhikers. <laughs> hey, Kevin, stop. Just stop. I picked up his hitchhiker. I was, what, 22? Hey, Kevin, come on, man. Seriously. Within five minutes. Already inside. Uh, that wasn't even a hitchhiker. Yeah, it was his hitchhiker. Like, no, yeah, a lot her, of her girlfriend, her gay girlfriend, flew out. So I swooped in and gave her some dick. <laughs> <laughs> I pulled it over. I was driving down the road, mind my own business. A mama and a daughter blew the horn. You so fine? I said, Yeah, how fine am I? <laughs> <laughs> hey, Kevin, come on. But man. you know what? I was married at the time to my ex wife. Man, I kept on going. I could have had me a mother and a daughter combo. I always wanted that. A mom and daughter? Yeah. It's just something. It's just so masculine. Yeah. You going inside the mom, right? Yeah. You go deep inside the daughter's right there playing with herself, right? <laughs> you just, just doing the mom. You pull out, slamming in a daughter. <laughs> hey, right? kid, what are we talking about? The daughter came out of her mama. You doing her mama, and you, you, you hitting it right, pull it out, and then... Open your legs, bam, right in the door. <laughs> and then when you about to come, right, you like put both of your faces together. <laughs> right on mommy and, and mommy and daughter's. Hey, Kim, what are we talking about? I don't know. All right, just stop. All right, so it's this old dude in uh, Taco Bell, right? And of course, in Taco Bell, it's some, well, I ain't going to say that. Well, it's a fat Mexican dude. He's the customer service. <laughs> he looks all disheveled. You can tell he hates his job because the job sucks. Well, you remember when we had a job as security guard? Man, I hated that job. I never ironed it, never washed it. Yeah, you had go. to show up to work. <laughs> look crazy. Because <laughs> my heart wasn't uh, in it. Yeah, you, know? you ain't getting paid none. You right? ain't getting paid none. And this ridiculous uniform. Just tried to make me wear that, 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 um, that, that damn hat like a damn state patrolman. I know that damn drill instructor. Yeah, drill instructor. I ain't wearing that shit. Yeah, yeah ain't no drill instructor. <laughs> I'm dead, huh? Hey, I'm, what, look at me like I'm a caricature of a real police officer. I ain't wearing that shit. Yeah, so so the, the the Taco Bell guy, he gets an argument with an old white guy. I think the white guy is a white supremacist. Why do you say that? He might be a patriot. I was just joking, Kelvin. Man, well, tell people you're joking, man. I was joking. It was a stupid joke anyway. I don't know. He probably was racist. Well, well you know, let's look at the video. You think he's racist? I don't know. I'm just... Yeah. Done. You're a fucking done. I'm gonna screw your ass off. Now I want you want to hold the food. Or you want to hold the food? I want to hold these food. Plus, you guys are gonna pay for my fucking microwave. It blew up. Oh, you're smiling. Yo, what the fuck? Yo, what the fuck? What's going on with you, bro? Bye. Man, I oughta beat that man an inch of his life. Kevin, as soon as he would have slapped me, I'd have grabbed this and pulled him over. <laughs> I'd have grabbed him, pulled him over, take his hat. 
It'd have, it'd have been a lot cooler. Hold on, let me do it again. Come on. Bam. Bam. That's what I did. Yeah, why you, you take my hat off? My hat? Yeah, put your hat back on. That dude's like, what the fuck? <laughs> But did your mama ever teach you somebody hit you, you hit them back? <laughs> That's the first thing I learned before I went to kindergarten. The first day of kindergarten, mom say, hey, somebody hit you, you suck them right in the neck. <laughs> or kick them in the neck, something. <laughs> well, I couldn't, man. That dude, it, it's like you were scared that of That white man got some quick reflex. You said a white man leaned in, he set it up. He, he was like this. <laughs> yeah, this was just hanging over here. <laughs> You see how he set it up? Yeah. Oh, you laughing? <laughs> did, did like he starts putting all his weight over here. <laughs> Just throw it over. That's crazy, man. That's crazy, man. Maybe he didn't hit him back because he's, he's old. No, at that point, if someone hits you, the law says you have a right to defend yourself. Yeah. Doesn't care about their age or anything. Yeah. That was a threat for my life. That's why I punched him. You know, that's why I kept punching because he thought he was going to get up. <laughs> so I kept punching and, and you know, I just saw red. And, and did he when stop I came moving? To, so. he, was, he wasn't here no more. <laughs> so, but he hit me first then. Yeah, I'm just working here at Taco Bell. I didn't come here looking for this. Well, he started laughing. Did you hear what the old man said? Yeah. said he put some Taco Bell foot in it and his, his microwave blew up. Yeah. So he's blaming Taco Bell for what happened to his microwave. He said, you're going to buy me a new microwave. <laughs> It was crazy. But the law says you have a right to defend yourself. Okay, how crazy is you are. I mean, think about it. You work at Taco you know Bell. What, man? Shut up! Think about it. You working in Taco Bell, right? <laughs> Some old white dude come back. Yeah, you gonna buy me a new microwave. <laughs> <laughs> I put your food in it, it just blew up. <laughs> and that gonna put a smile on your face like, first of all, I have nothing to do with your microwave. <laughs> And it has nothing to do with your food, yeah. you dumb fuck. Well, your microwave did blow up. Probably the food blew up, but the microwave still works. No, nah, man, you know what? He probably had something in the microwave, like some aluminum foil or something. He probably put something in there that shouldn't be a uh, microwave. Yeah. They, they, they it on the yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, he took right. the, yeah. He probably took the Taco Bell and it's got that aluminum foil wrap yeah. on it. He put it in and it blew up. <laughs> Oh, stupid old white man <laughs> in there blaming the fat Mexican. <laughs> you know, uh, blaming the fat Mexican dude in there <laughs> for your stupidity. Yeah. That is so white of you. <laughs> <laughs> Sound like some old white man with you. <laughs> yeah, that was crazy, man. But that dude, man, he's lucky, man. How many some... people would take that? Well, that um, that white dude, they good at sizing people up. You know what I'm saying? Wife calling, man. Yeah, white white man, people good man. at sizing you up. He knew he wasn't gonna do nothing. Yeah, he knew it because that dude's a patriot. He knew when who to pick on and who not to pick on. <laughs> it's a damn good show. Yeah, the people are crazy, man. It's a crazy where we live in. It is, people are crazy. That's crazy, man. He took the package. It's got the aluminum foil on. He put it in the microwave. Everybody know you don't supposed to put that in the microwave. He puts it in there, blows up, goes down the taco bell, <laughs> and smacks the cash. <laughs> That's, That's some, a damn good that show. That's some shit a nigga would do. <laughs> Hey, we got a new giveaway going. We'll give away a 40, 50, 50 and 10,000 cash to enter the win. Go to fishhawkstwins.com. Anything you buy from the site gets you automatically into the win. Yeah. yeah.